The city of Shanghai in China has been under lockdown since March following a surge in COVID-19 cases. Chinese authorities reported 87 deaths so far, 39 of which were reported just last Sunday, April 24. According to the Philippine Consulate in Shanghai, at least 10 Filipinos tested positive for COVID-19. This footage, sent to Advocates Philippines, shows a quarantine facility in Shanghai. Noticeable is the lack of dividers between bedridden patients that could have reduced contamination risk. The facility's bathrooms and urinals are also without doors. Some beds were even set up next to garbage bins. There are also concerns about the facility's water source. Some patients call the quarantine facility a terrible place for healing. They also express concern over the risk of cross-infection. Filipinos residing in Shanghai are calling on the Philippine government for help. Labor Secretary Silvestre Rebello III said the government had already sent food and medicine to China to help Filipino workers affected by the lockdown. The Department of Foreign Affairs is also in the process of identifying Filipinos who need financial assistance. Medicina sa kanila, and as soon as may identify natin sila upon instruction of DFA, we will give them the usual grant of $200 per OFW. According to some OFWs, a no work, no pay arrangement had been implemented in the city since the lockdown. The Overseas Workers' Welfare Administration already met with the Philippine Consulate General in Shanghai over this and other related problems. They are still formulating a plan of action to assist around 4,000 Filipinos in Shanghai. This is Bea Bernardo for Advocates Philippines.